dear one, Miss Lloyd here with a little Just Right activity for you all. Um, I will put the Just Right activity on the school website where we normally put them. Um, <laughs> where we normally put them. So mummies and daddies and you guys know where to go and find them. Now you might have already guessed this one running round behind me and uh, we have decided from talking to you that it would be a good idea to have our just right be all about pets hello say hello tilly we know that lots of you at home have been looking after your pets very very well and um, during lockdown and we know that some of you even have brand new pets like this brand new puppy here and some of you she's off some of you have been caring for pets um, of your relatives, which is very, very kind of you. So hopefully you will all have something to write about. However, if you've not got a pet, because we know not all of you have got a pet, there is a section at the bottom of the Just Right, a little separate Just Right, just for you, so you can write about your dream pet. So what you'd like to call your pet, what you'd have. Miss Lloyd might have a sausage dog, for example, and dress her up in lots of flowery clothes, even if it was a boy, probably dress him up as well. Um, so that bit's for you if you don't have a pet, we'd like you to tell us all about your dream pet and what your dream pet would be. So if you have got a pet, we want to know all about it, okay? We want to know what it looks like, if you dress it up in clothes, what you've been teaching it to do, if anything, <laughs> what type of pet you've got, how old they are. There are lots of questions listed for you on the Just Right. So we have got here, she's been a very good girl at the moment. She's staying still. This is video take 9,000. She didn't want to stay on the camera the rest of the time. So we have got Tilly here. Can you tell us a bit about Tilly, Mabel? She is four, three weeks. Okay, so she's 14 weeks old. Are you 14 weeks old, Tilly? And this is she's her favourite unicorn toy. Oh, that's her unicorn toy that she absolutely loves. Yeah, that, um... She looks a bit tired, let's My get and Lana's friend. Oh, oh, so this, everybody, is Tilly. Oh, no, that's the unicorn. There we go. Oh, yeah, look at that, Tilly. So she is a black cocker spaniel, and she's incredibly soft. She's very, very wriggly and likes to um, move around. She's got a little black speckle here white. on her tummy. A, little, a white speckle, yeah, she's black with a white speckle <laughs> on her tummy that we could write about. Oh, she's got lovely curly ears, haven't you? She's very, very pretty as well. So when me and Mabel were having a little bit of a chat, um, like what you'll do at home about the different things that we could say about Tilly and then write about Tilly. We came up with, um, we put them down on some paper just so we've got a bit of a word bank. So when, when we're writing, it's very easy to forget what we were going to write next and um, remember all those brilliant ideas that we've had a chat about. So it'll be best for you at home if you can just make a little word bank so that when you do get a bit of writer's block, it's there for you to go back to, or you could do a few sentences using some of these words one day, and then another day you can add to it and use some verbs to say, you know, the different things that you do, or the different things that your pet does. So we've come up with, um, we've got black, we've got soft, we've got smooth, she's very cute, she's got curly ears, she's clever, she's fast, speedy, playful, she's very, very friendly. Um, so we could use all that vocab up there to um, create some sentences. And then we've also gone on to put a few verbs down at the bottom. So our doing words, our action words about the things that we do with Tilly. So we tickle her, feed her, brush her, cuddle her, care for her, play with her, train her. Now she's very, very clever. She's learned lots already. She knows how to sit, pour, fetch day and we walk her so that might be a useful idea for you to create something similar to that at home you to come back over here tilly come on come on on the camera i'm getting don't you be camera shy come on i think there are just lots of new smells for her and lots of things to for her to explore here because 
Tilly lives with Mabel and her daddy. She doesn't live here. So at the moment, this is all very new to her. She's been out for a very long walk this morning as well. And she's not had as new. So she looks like a little bit of a sleepy head. So I hope you enjoy um, having a go at writing about your pets. Or your dream pets. Please do send your writing in to me and Mr Tomo. So we can have a look at it and share it with you. Because we'd love to know all about um, the pets that you've been caring for or what your dream pet would be as well so I hope you have fun doing that and I hope it keeps you busy for a little bit and I look forward to reading them so I'll see you soon I miss you all very very much have fun <laughs>